Hello everyone to another Katan video here on my channel T site ABCD and uh, in this game I'm just playing a random black forest uh, casual mode game uh, I am in the third position so that's fine here I think I can go for something like 610 and point my road downwards the only other decent option was 8-9 which has already been picked up and now that green has also picked up uh, uh, green has gone for 6-10 I think I will just go for 5-10 here yeah, I don't think there is anything else that is uh, better than this maybe I can go for 9-4 point my road upwards and then get something like 659 as my second settlement uh, that way I do start with different numbers but I think just 510 or maybe I don't even start with a port I don't think that's the right strategy though so maybe I can go for something like yeah I think I'll just go for 510 and um, 694 here and I will point my road outwards just so that I can explore new tiles and luckily I do get a break early on that's pretty good generally on these games it's better to place your roads close by but um, in this case sorry settlements close by but in this case I am placing them on the opposite ends uh, it, anyways uh, let's take a look at the board so you need 15 cards to win the discard limit is 7 and um, Friendly robber is also active. Okay. So here, surely I will be able to explore uh, early on. So, yeah, here just build a new road I also get sheep just like green does here but at this point I think I'll just end my turn I don't think I need to explore more I will try and get a settlement on uh, 654 first that will basically give me brick production the numbers are also pretty decent oh sorry I just forgot to end the turn there Let's see what black does. Roll then 11. So now once I get a settlement on 654, I would like if lots and lots of sixes roll, basically giving me a road every time. That would be pretty good. Here I'm not sure if, yeah, not sure if black has quit the game or is he still playing. Because the friendly robber is active, not much that I can do here. I'll just try and block green a little bit and just end my turn. Yeah, not sure if black is here. Oh, 6 does roll there, but at this point I do not get any break. Yeah, looks like... Black has just quit the game early on. That's a little disappointing. I was actually looking forward to playing this game. Actually, maybe Black is back. Wow, Black is exploring quite a few old tiles. Wow. wow. Green is also getting pretty lucky with these early rolls. Here, although if I build an early settlement, people will target me. I do know that. But I think just getting a settlement on 654 is very strong. Especially because if a 6 rolls, I do not even have to convert my wood now. I can directly start building roads. Wouldn't want any 7s to roll. I think that would be pretty bad. Wow, a 6 does roll here. So 
here if uh, black hasn't sorry green hasn't explored this new uh, the foggy tile here i will try and explore that or else i'll just build a road towards 104 black is wasting quite a long a lot of time there which is a little unfortunate i mean this game can be very quick but uh, that's not the case here Wow, one other six does roll here. So as planned, I'll just explore the new tile. I'm very lucky to get wheat. And also the numbers are pretty decent here. Yeah, five basically gives me a sheep and a wood. Also noticing that there are lots of fives on this board and uh, quite a few nines as well. Yeah, this is going to be a tedious game if black just continues to waste time. But uh, yeah, and black does black was quick, uh, kicked, which is pretty good. So now I think just targeting. Green seems to be the best choice and uh, here I'll just get a settlement and explore new fog tiles here. Hopefully I get ore as well. I get more wheat. I don't mind that. The only issue is my numbers are very limited to sixes here. So I would rather prefer getting a few new numbers. That said, every time a six rolls, it's a pretty strong roll for me. And here I can explore more tiles. I get more sheep. Okay. So at this point, rather than getting a settlement on 1046, I think I'll just continue exploring more. Although I'm getting good resources and the numbers are pretty decent as well. But um, the only negative part is that I'm not getting any ore. And here I think I'll just continue to target black, uh, sorry, uh, green. With the cards I have, I can go for a dev card. I think I'll just do that. And also I need to get a city soon. So that is also something that I have in mind. Wow, green is... Also getting a little unfortunate, I would surely say that. Getting so much uh, brick is might not be the best case on, in this game. Another six rolls there, a pretty good roll for me, for sure. And because the eight is black, uh, eight is blocked, uh, green doesn't get a card. Also, I think Monopoly on this game is in on this board is very very strong So it is surely something that I am keeping in mind Finally, I do get some ore and uh, So that's why I'll first get a settlement on 654 just so that I have better ore production Although 3 isn't too strong, but something is better than nothing. I would surely say that here are seven rolls and I think I'll give up on all the yeah, I think I'll give up on the reason why I did not give up wood is because I want to explore the new tile here on 4-3 and now I think I'll just block black uh, sorry green again I do get wood back so that's pretty good and now I'll continue to target his brick and explore the new tiles here. So even I get more brick, not the best case scenario, but surely not the worst either. 
let's see if I explore this, what do I get? Wow, I get more wheat. So, pretty fine with the current placements here. So now I hope a few sixes roll and I will surely try and get a city. Seems like bot will be the first one to get a city and yeah, bot does get a city here. So now these eights help bot quite a lot. Wow, a six does roll here. With the current cards that I have, I think my best move is to just convert my wood into a ore and end my turn. Because once I get a city on 694 and uh, maybe 6. Yeah, I mean quite a few places where I would want to get cities. That said, I cannot build any more settlements until I get a city. So surely something that I'm... Wow, unfortunately uh, 7 is rolled. I will give away my wheat and sorry brick and sheep just because I want to hold on for an old city. Luckily, green is not able to steal my wheat or ore. And in return, I get a sheep from green. Maybe I can just go for another dev card. I get road building. Okay. Uh, maybe not the best card at this point. It does give me the option to explore new tiles on the top or the new fork tiles on top. Certainly isn't the worst, but um, let's see. Here a six would be excellent, basically giving me a city. Instead a 9 rolls. 9 is fine as well because that also does give me a city. And I will just city up 694 increasing my wood production. And I am immediately rewarded with a 9 roll there. Here, maybe because of the road building, I can also try and get a settlement on 510 and this uh, unknown tile. That would be pretty fine as well. Wow, I'm getting quite lucky with these 7s. Being able to target green is pretty good. And wow, 6... 9510 seems to be an excellent spot to get a settlement, but I think getting a settlement on the other 9510 will be even better. So basically, a single 6 will actually not a 6, maybe a 5. Is fine as well, only I get some more. I do not get anything out of 11, but I think at this point I'll just go for another dev card. I do get a knight, so I will be able to get the largest army. So seems like green is back here, which is a little unfortunate because sorry, black is back. I didn't realize that I thought it was always a bot playing for black. Here, green will surely block me. And I'll just play my knight, secure the largest army and continue to target green here. With that 10 roll, I can't do much, so I'll just end my turn. Surely hoping for a 6 to roll.
Wow, a six does roll here. That's pretty good for me. I'm not sure what those trades are. Here, I have to give away all my cards. That's a little unfortunate with the current setup, but I think it's still fine. Yeah, I do get a settlement on 9510. That seems very, very strong. Especially if I get a city over there, my ore and wheat production would go, will increase quite a bit. Especially with these sixes. Wouldn't mind if green rolls a seven. Yeah, maybe black should not have been allowed back in the game. Just wasting time for everyone. Now 10 does give me a ore and a wood. Looks like green is just going for another city, which is fine. Yeah, I'm, I am getting a little unfortunate with these rolls exactly at the wrong time. I do get a brick, but I think I'll just go for another dev card here. Try, hope and get a monopoly. I keep getting these knights. No VPs either, which is a little unfortunate. Wow. The 6 8 10 spots looks looks very juicy. Unfortunately, my brick is blocked. And now I cannot get any more settlements. I still need to get a city before I can get a settlement. But at this point, I think I'll just go for another dev card. I don't think that's the bad choice. Another night, wow. So absolutely unfortunate here. Yeah, surely don't mind fours rolling, giving me three woods. Actually, four does help black also quite a bit. And I think black should try and connect their settlements. That way they secure the longest road for themselves. So yeah, green will again target me. Wow, black gives away four ores. That's really surprising. Here, I'll just continue to play my knight. I get a sheep that's quite fine because that does give me the option of going for another dev card here. Still hoping to get a monopoly. Wow. Keep getting these knights. That's surely a little unfortunate. Even a year of plenty would be fine. So now I do have a city in hand. Hopefully I don't roll a 7. So green also goes for another city. And wow, it, that's how my luck has been this entire game. I do get a sheep though, that's 
pretty nice and now I get road building so most likely I will be able to explore the fog tile on the top right but still a little unfortunate that I haven't been able to pull any monopolies or year of plenty even after such a long time it actually makes the game quite easy for green and yeah here I'll just try and explore the new island wow I actually run out of tiles here I did not even realize that and I keep on getting these knights I am surprised that green and black haven't gone for any more uh, cities though I mean sorry dev cards though so here black trying to get the longest road is surely the right move and wow those threes were pretty good for me basically making sure that I can get another city which at this point is absolutely necessary for me I was falling behind I am actually quite far behind I would say yep. so black should try and get the longest road doesn't do that though which is unfortunate and a 10 rolls there so let's see what green does green can just go for a couple of dev cards and pull for the win or try and pull for the win yeah, he does go for one and here I'll just end I mean play my knight I do get an ore that's pretty good so basically with that ore I think I'll just go for another city and at this point I think I'll just get a city at Now my, my, I would like to increase my sheep production a little that's why I am getting a city on 6, 4, 5 also that increases my brick production so now 6 will basically give me 3 roads which actually doesn't do anything yeah I should have considered that maybe getting a city on 6, 5, 3 would have been slightly better because I can't build any more roads that said now that black has gotten the longest road I I'm at much more at ease. Five would be an excellent roll for me. Instead, I roll a four, and with all those cards, I think I think I'll just go for a few dev cards. Wow. I have to say I have been quite unlucky. Wow, yeah, absolutely unlucky here. It basically makes sure that other people keep on getting the good cards, whereas I am stuck with these bad ones that I don't need anymore. Yeah, not even one VP or Monopoly, no year of plenty. I did get both the road buildings, but one of them was wasted. Surely don't mind fours. Again, a five would be pretty good roll. Six would be excellent, but I think there isn't enough wheat on board. Sorry, uh, wood on the board uh, in the bank. that was expected actually I'll keep on some wood I do get sheep that is pretty good let's see if I can do something else I finally get a VP
Yeah. Uh, black rolls a seven. Black will most likely block me on the six word. I wouldn't mind if black blocks the nine wheat. Okay, uh, blocks me on on the six break. Wow, did not expect that. So green here is surely on fourteen points. I'll roll the die before. Uh, okay, I roll an eight though. So would not have changed anything. I get a break. So maybe at this point, I'll just uh, make my peace by getting a settlement on six three four, increasing my ore production by a little. Hopefully, black can roll a seven. Unfortunately, that doesn't happen. If black has a monopoly, black should surely play it on break here. Yeah. So maybe I'll lose this game after having such a strong setup, just because I got unlucky with these dev cards. Yeah. So black most likely is on fourteen. I believe green is also on fourteen. Yeah, and black just wins the game there, and I end up on the last position. Wow! So, yeah, no monopolies, no year of plenties. There is an option to rematch, but uh, I don't think so. I'll be doing that here. Yeah. I mean, although this was a casual game, it was pretty unfortunate for me getting all those knights. and road buildings yeah anyway uh, bye for now and see you again in the next video bye bye